Nicole Scott here for Netbook News, and here we have a little treat with a education-based tablet from Shuttle. So this is a 8-inch tablet. It's focused on the education market. Uh, it's been launched here in Taiwan uh, on a project called the e-school bag. I think they're looking at three schools right now, ramping up to about 16 over uh, this school year. Um, they have made some really interesting things. So you can see that it's running actually on uh, Android 2.2, but they've actually done a front end specifically for education. So you can see you can roll through all the apps right here. We have, we have a couple of the familiar ones like Polaris Office, uh, this Inside Market, it's an up and running now, but this is where they're going to be putting all of their apps um, that are for education specifically, because they don't actually want um, access to the marketplace since there are a lot of dangerous apps in there. Uh, if we keep on looking, there's the web browser. This isn't actually connected, so let's take a look at one of their apps here. Let's just, let's launch that. So they actually have their own book reader here. And go back along. There's this is a diary for between uh, community community between teacher, parent, and student. So it's not actually online. That's why these errors keep coming up. Uh, things like Polaris Office. There's a camera. Let's see if we can just quickly check out the resolution on this camera. The display is actually 800 by 600, but they're going to be having a higher resolution uh, upon launch. So you can see there, there's a couple of, it's not, not terrible resolution on the camera. But this is running on the Tiger 2 platform, so this should be capable of um, HD video. But let's just take a look around the system, actually, to take a look at some of this stuff. So there's actually a door right here on the side doesn't actually stay open easily, but uh, you can see there is a blocked off SIM card slot there. We have a full USB 2.0. There's a micro SD card, and if the school wants, you can actually block that off if they don't want them um, using it. This uh, is capable up to 32 gigs, and the internal memory of this unit is 4 gigs. There's HDMI out because Tiger 2 is capable of that. If we keep on going along the top, we have a lock for the screen, power button, another little port flap there, and that's for their micro USB and the headphone jack. And if we keep on going, there's the volume rocker. Around this side we have, I think that's the speaker. Around the back we have the camera here. Uh, there actually is nothing else on the back. And nothing on the bottom. And we're back to this side here with the ports. Oh, so you actually see this actually comes with a, a ruggedized case. Um, the question of the day, oh, and it is capacitive touch, and it actually also does have a pen here. And if you see there, the pen actually, it's got a little, see where you can take it apart and move it around. The case actually feels like it's uh, extremely well built. Um, the cool thing about this case actually is this tablet is, is ruggedized. Um, you can drop it from about waist high, uh, but with the case, you can actually drop it from about chest high. So I think that's like 70 centimeters or so. Uh, it has a little latch here, but the case d does feel extremely rugged, very well put together. Um, but the other interesting thing is that this is actually water resistant. And you can see that this is a very, it's, a, it's actually made of metal, so that's, it could be a little weapon for the kids to use, I guess. <laughs> This has been a quick look at the EduPal, the 8.9 inch tablet uh, from Shuttle that's aimed at the education market and since the uh, working with the schools is going to end June of next year, we should definitely check back in to find out what kind of custom software the schools have decided to come up with to maximize the use of these tablets. So that'll be an interesting discovery. So I'm Nicole Scott for Netbook News taking a look at the EduPal.